The Tall One Experience. I think it's a black eye and a blight uh, to the community uh, that the church has been overwhelmingly silent around gun control, not just around Parkland, but when you look at uh, Mother Emanuel AME Church in South Carolina, where nine were senselessly killed in Bible study. Uh, for that incident alone, I think that the church needs to be on the front line and lift its voice. Well, certainly I think, again, the church has to take its place in standing up and coming together and addressing the gun violence that are happening across this country. Something has to be done by getting these guns out of these teenagers' hands because psychologically many of them are dealing with issues that are not even being revealed. So my take on it, I think we really have to do a serious background check and try to figure out what's going on with these young people and in their minds because that's why we're seeing the murders we just saw in Florida again. But not only Florida, it's happening again across the country so we got to take a stand in this season do everything we have to do to help stop this um, gun violence but the reality is that I, I'm actually a gun owner and uh, my son uh, who is uh, 24 years old he has his uh, you know uh, you know concealed carry license I have my concealed carry license um, I, I do think that there need to be things put in place in order to ensure and to make sure that young kids are not able to, to get these these types of weapons in order to create mass destruction. You know, I, I know what people are saying, you know, the reality is that guns don't kill people, people do. Um, but but we just need to make it more difficult for people to get those types of guns so that they can kill people. Did you like the video? That's right, did you like it? Hit that like button, subscribe, Think and big. share it. Think tall, think tall boys.